I just got home from the gym. I took Remy out and then I'm gonna take a shower, get all clean for the night. I'm going to make some dinner for home, kind of just chill and have a chill night at home. And yeah, so it's gonna be fun. Can you sit? Can you shake? Can you shake? Good girl. Can you high five? High five, good girl. We got home from the CrossFit Games yesterday at like 5.30. It was very good, a very good experience. I loved it. I decided to work on my goals in fitness. My goal really is to just be the best that I can be and be a healthy me. And I knew that I had an unhealthy body image, but I just thought like, mm, it's not that big of a deal. But I brought it to the Lord and like, I love to eat, I love food. Food is fuel. You realize that food is fuel. You understand what's healthy, what's not. I wouldn't even allow myself to eat a meal. And it could have been like good, fulfilling foods for me that I convinced myself that I could not eat because I need to lose weight. I don't know why I thought like that. Anyways, if you are going through that right now, girl, go get some food. Like, fuel yourself because one thing I've learned is that if we don't take care of ourselves, if we don't honor the temple that the Lord has given us, like making sure that we're healthy, making sure that our body is ready for the day, um, physically, spiritually, mentally, emotionally, then we're not going to be able to serve people at the best we can. There's your little TED talk for today's video. I'm just really passionate about um, body image because I went through it and I didn't even realize that that was a struggle for me until I was out of it. So if you're feeling that right now, if you're going through it, um, just take it to the Lord. He will help you. you're good you'll get a treat you ready to get a treat yeah you ready to get a treat we are getting ready to take Remy to her first hair appointment hair appointment oh my gosh her hair first haircut Remy come here come here oh my goodness yeah she is so shaggy like you can barely see her eyes I'm just gonna clean up it's kind of like stuffy in here. There's stuff laying around, as you can tell. So that when we come home from her appointment, we can just chill, relax, and yeah. Before um, we clean up, I got this in the mail today. And it says, in our home as it is in heaven. I have been wanting a sign like this for such a long time. So it came in today. It's a custom from Mod and Glory. I found her on Instagram. And... It is just the sweetest thing ever. I love the style of writing. I got to choose how big I wanted the sign to be. I got to choose what font I wanted. I wanted something different, unique, and kind of just out of the ordinary. I didn't want something cursive because I didn't want it to be too hard to read. I think this is perfect and it just gets the message across. I'm going to hang it right by the door so that you can literally see the sign from any point of the house. So cute. Can't wait to show you guys how I style it. I'm gonna get a frame to put it in, put it, by, put it by the door, and then I'll show you what it looks like when I hang it. If you are looking for custom signs, I highly recommend her she's super sweet um love her values and morals and yeah she's just super sweet and she made ordering this super easy and reliable
proper and classy. Yes, you do. <laughs> you sit? Can you sit? Oh, look at that girl. She's so pretty and bougie. She's a lady. Look at that lady. <laughs> so I think I'm just gonna do something fairly easy because it's already seven o'clock. I'm gonna cook dinner and chill for a little bit before bed. Today I didn't work out, it's Tuesday, usually I do, but Remy had that appointment. Let's make dinner. <laughs> good protein for the night in the air fryer so that I can be hands on with the vegetables. Love it. 